I fully understand that I could just go fuck a man, but it ain't that easy for me. Plus, I'm wife with a chick who despises the dick and all she believes it to be. But at least five of my friends and family members have recently had abortions. To me, it's crazy. Spending 13 G's on a two but come for one don't sound too dumb. Shit, I just want a baby. Oh, I want a baby I can promote from big boy to little man to my pride. With my pride and my people and maybe my eyes. I wouldn't mind a little girl. I just can't do her hair. But I'm upwardly mobile. I can afford the daycare. I want a baby I can teach how to game and play fair. I know the world is only getting worse and I do get scared, but I got a lot to pass on. I got a legacy to leave. And the thought of a heavy belly weighs steadily to me. And sometimes I want to show a man just once that I don't hate him just because I won't date him. In fact, I often love him enough to want to recreate him. Uh -huh. And we can debate a lot of things, but my womanhood ain't going to stop. And hormones going to do what they do, just like biological clocks that keep ticking in my ear like a ghost eternal moans that keep rattling the marrow in my most maternal bones. And this piece ain't really about my political views. It's just that the truth is, I do get a little bitter about luxuries like busted rubbers and oopsies. Because while women are out there using murder like it's birth control, yeah. I'm watching Huggies commercials crying like it hurt my soul. Oh, I'm planning. I'm foster parents and puppies. I am onesies in Walmart. I swear I don't want a teenager, but where does it all start? One day I'ma pop up knocked up, and before y'all get over that whole part, some little spoiled nappy head will take over my whole heart and stash it in muddy jars, rip pockets, and tiny blankets that grow too small to cover a man's toes, so he'll leave it alone and break it, and I'll have to learn to let him go and learn his lessons, and after a while, shit, I'll curse my irresistible self for giving him that fucking smile, and, and he or she will make me proud, and I'll scream loud at school events. I'll try to make up for my childhood, probably love him too intense. I'll try to undo the absence of men like my mother did for my father. And I might never be perfect, but I will always be bothered. So I'm sending prayers through poems, hoping God may write back in the form of a miracle, and I can make a mistake like that. Yeah.